answer to question Three point one point two. The question states that the coordinate of G, if the equation of BG is the equation of BG, we have equation of BG, which is seven X minus ten Y equal to eight. Let us consider the line AC. Line AC is a straight line. We have the equation of AC and the gradient of AC, gradient of AC is equal to gradient of AD because they are on the same straight line. They are on the same straight line. The equation of AC will be the same thing as the equation of AG and the equation of Equation of, equation of AC is equal to equation of AG. We have the equation of AC. The equation of AC is Y equal to minus 3 over 2X plus 8. Let us make this equation to be nilia by removing the the, the the fraction multiply everything by two we are going to have two y equal to minus three x plus sixteen so let us let us bring this three uh, minus three x to other side it's going to give us three x plus two y equal to sixteen let us make this equation to be our equation 1, this equation to equation 2. So let us compare the two equations together, which is 7x minus 10y equal to 8. 3x plus 2y equal to 16. We need to use elimination method of solving this simultaneous equation. In that case, let us multiply this one by 2, equation 1 by 2, and the equation 2 by negative 10. We are going to have another equation, which is uh, 14x minus 20y equal to 16. Minus 30x minus 20y equal to 160. Minus 160. This is minus 160. So let us this one form our equation 3 and this one form our equation 4. So equation... Four minus equation three. We have minus thirty x minus fourteen x equal to minus one sixty minus sixteen. So we are going to have minus forty four x equal to minus 176. We divide both sides by negative 44. So x is going to give us minus 176 divided by negative 44. x is equal to 4. We have the value for x now. We can substitute for the any of our equation, either equation 1, equation 2, equation 3, or equation 4 to get our y. But let us take equation 1. Put x is equal to 4 into equation 1. So we have 7x minus 10y equal to 8. 7 into 4 minus 10y equal to 8. 28 minus 10y equal to 8. 
Let us collect the left times. Minus 10y is equal to 8 minus 28. Minus 10y is equal to negative 20. Minus 20. We divide both sides by what? By negative 10. y is equal to minus 20 divided by minus 10, which is equal to 2. We have our y now. And the g must be written in form of x and y. Therefore, the coordinate of g is 4 and 2. The coordinate of, of g is 4 and 2. y is 2. x is 4. x is equal to 4. Y is equal to 2. This is the end of question 3.1.2.